Hi, my name is Chang Vu, and I'm the Global Product Manager for Magnetic Flow Meters with Emerson. I'll be walking through how to troubleshoot a Rosemont 8712EM transmitter when no AO power is detected. No AO power issues are most likely due to wiring or reverse polarity on the analog terminals, though there are four things we can check and verify. First, verify the analog switch position. The analog switch can be accessed by opening the 8712 electronics compartment cover. The analog switch determines the source of the 4 to 20 milliamp loop power. Ensure that the switch is set to the appropriate position based on the analog output power requirements. Internal, if powered internally by the transmitter. External, if powered by the 10 to 30 volt DC external power supply. The switch is in the internal position when the transmitter is shipped from the factory. Second, verify the analog 4 to 20 milliamp loop wiring. If the transmitter is supplying loop power, the positive wire must land on terminal 8, while the negative wire lands on terminal 7. If there is an external power supply powering the analog output, the negative wire must land on terminals 8, while the positive wire lands on terminal 7. Next, for externally powered loops, verify sufficient power. If the analog power switch is set properly to the external position and there is no external loop power, verify power supply requirements. DC supply voltage must be between 10 to 30 volts DC depending on the resistance in the analog output loop. 24 volt DC is a common power supply voltage to allow for the 250 ohms resistance required for heart communication. Last, check for open loop. The no AO power alert message will activate if there's no connection between terminals 7 and 8. To fix this, install resistance across the analog output terminals 7 and 8 in the form of a resistor or jumper wire. If the analog output channel is not being used, the no AO power alert message can be masked or turned off. To mask or turn off the alert message, press the transmitter menu key. Next, press the down arrows to scroll through the options and press the right arrow on detailed setup. Press the down arrow to scroll through the menu options and press the right arrow on LOI config. Then press the down arrow to scroll through the menu options and press the right arrow to select LOI error mask. Press the right arrow to select no AO power and press the right arrow to select on. Press the E button to save the value. Finally, press the E button again to save your selection. These corrective actions should resolve the no AO power error on the transmitter. However, if the error is still showing, please contact your local Emerson representative.